Hey there, my name is Jude. Um, I'm trans, non-binary, and my pronouns are they, them. And this video is gonna be a little bit different than my normal content because I'm going to do it in one take. Um, to cut down on editing time. But I couldn't resist picking up my camera and talking to you about Ash Hardell's recent video that they posted about their coming back to the internet after um, being basically offline um, for like two and a half years. And I thought that Ash's video was fantastic. Um, I wasn't really expecting them to come back, much less give us like a whole hour long video explaining what they went through and why they decided to stop posting YouTube videos. Um, and yeah, it's just, I think that what they made is just so good. Um, this is kind of gonna be my like video response to it. And I basically just wanted to like spend some time talking about how amazing this video is and um, how Ash's content has like shaped my life um, and like all of the positive impacts that it's had on me and like people that I know. Um, I think Ash is just an amazing creator and if you don't follow them or subscribe and like if you haven't seen their video yet, definitely take a look at it. It's really fantastic. And um, like they mentioned in the video that they just posted, Ash kind of had like a brush with virality, um, like got a lot of, you know, um, media attention um, from like people, especially from people outside of the trans community when some of their videos went viral. And the really hard thing that they talk about is kind of how when their videos started breaking out of their like core audience when like I guess the mainstream like people started talking about it and when people who had been radicalized came across their content they experienced a ton of backlash a ton of hate and all of the trauma that they went through I'm really grateful for Ash having the courage to share that experience because I had a like I had some sense of the of the fact that they were experiencing a lot of these problems, but I had no idea to the extent that like how much hate they were receiving. Um, and it's, I think it's really, it's such a powerful video because Ash isn't afraid to talk about all of the really hard things that they've gone through. And they have really carefully like thought through all of these really harmful arguments and provide really amazing and careful, carefully constructed counterpoints. Um, and they've really kind of like gone through this process of, of understanding like, wow, you know, there's, there's actually really nothing to all of this hate other than just like fear and a lot of misinformation. Um, I, it's just such a work of art. Um, also, as a filmmaker um, and someone that works in multimedia, I was blown away by the production of this video. I've always admired Ash's creativity and her style and how she like creates and, and shares stories and the aesthetic and the music and the idea of like pulling support and and creativity from his community and like constructing it all together in videos it's always been such an amazing thing to watch how how ash's videos have progressed um and i've been like super inspired by them but um this one was just like another level of of fantastic like the i loved all of the sets and and how he did his makeup and like um just like all the cool props um the jokes to like alleviate some of the tension because it was such a heavy serious topic um the music like ah, everything was just like so so good i um sometimes have a hard time watching videos that are that long but i was like 
captivated for the entire hour that I watched this video. Um, the, the only reason why I needed to take a break halfway through was just because of how serious and personal the topic is to me, because I'm trans as well. Um, and so it kind of just became like a lot emotionally to like continue watching it. And I love that Ash like explained that in the beginning that it would be a really serious topic so that you could like take the time to process that and decide if you were ready to to like view this content. But um, if, you know, if not for that, I was just so incredibly glued to the screen and just like really, really, um, taking in everything. It was like, it was just really easy to watch and pay attention to because of how like friendly Ash is and and how like accessible and interesting they make their videos. Um, I think the whole thing was just really well done. And I just wanna say to, to Ash and like to everyone that this is a phenomenal video. Um, really like one of the best things out there to if you're trying to like understand the trans experience like what trans people online can face um, and all of the hate and backlash that that we can receive sometimes um, and also like starting to break down a lot of the misconceptions about trans people um, I'm so happy that Ash is back and um, I can't wait for you know more content like this um, I'm just really I, I'm obviously saddened to like hear the the real in-depth explanation of what happened to them but I'm so happy for them that they were able to create this content out of this incredibly horrible experience and and the fact that they have been able to come back to YouTube despite everything that they've gone through um, the work that Ash has done I have to say like so first of all a lot of the creators or like okay so basically the reason why I like was able to figure out my gender identity and and come out as non-binary, come out as trans, um, like be able to like start my medical transition and and learn about this like community and these identities. It's all thanks to online creators. Um, the like place that I grew up didn't have any kind of like LGBT education. Um, my family didn't like know about being LGBT and didn't talk about it. It just basically like was something that people pretended didn't exist. Um, because they were like afraid to like talk about it or like they couldn't talk about it. Um, so I didn't know what, like I didn't know that trans people existed until I started college. And if it weren't for creators like Ash, I would not have figured it out at all. And my life would probably look very different. It would be I would be so sad and depressed and unable to like be myself if it weren't for like these amazing people like Ash that were able to share their stories online and worked really hard to provide that educational content and create those communities. So literally without YouTube, I probably wouldn't be here or I would just be so unhappy. So I have, I, I owe Ash, you know, just an incredible amount of gratitude and just thank you so much for everything that you've done but um yeah so like there's a ton of creators that i learned so much from because they shared their stories online and on youtube but ash was probably the one that i learned the most from and i bought their book the abcs of lgbtq plus i like i watched all of their content they have an incredible incredible um just archive of videos on youtube uh explaining like tons of different lgbt identities and it's just like one of the most comprehensive channels that i've seen for this kind of ex educational content about the lgbt community and 
but like in addition to that their videos are always just so engaging and and fun and they like talk about really serious topics but like also throw in these like moments of comic relief um also like ash's journey with their partner gray as well has just been phenomenal to watch and they both are so generous with what they have shared about their lives online and and their like respective journeys with coming out as trans and like discovering their identities and um, deciding if they wanted to get top surgery and what their pronouns would be and all these things. It's just been so fantastic to see them as a queer couple go through these things together. And the fact that they were so open about it is just amazing and beautiful. And I just, I think it's just so, it's just so awesome that Ash can come back now and continue to, to share those things. Um, I never faulted them for a second for taking a break. And I never felt like, man, I wish you would just come back already because creators, you know, don't owe you that. They don't owe you anything. I've always just felt so happy and so lucky to be able to have this insight from them and and for her to share these things with us is just really really cool <laughs> and really really helpful um so yeah if you like haven't looked into ash hardell at all um i'll have links in the description for you to check check out some of their videos and their book and everything um but this one in particular is just such a gem. Um, definitely go check it out. Um, that's pretty much all I wanted to say, just that I am super, super happy that this video exists now and that I'm super happy that Ash is back. Welcome back to YouTube, Ash. And thank you so much for everything. I, I am always looking forward to the next things that you create.